This magnificent day-old farm estate, once owned by a renowned singer and civil rights activist, Harry Belafonte, went on the market some years ago for $2.9 million. We're, doing, we're talking about this one today because we just lost Mr. Belafonte. I believe he was at 96 years old from congestive heart failure. So our condolences from the Real Estate Insider to the family of Mr. Harry Belafonte, all right? Now, this, this farm includes a colonial home built in 1792, and it sits on 100-plus acres. Now, the property located in Chatham, upstate New York, uh, is, uh, he owned this property in the 50s all the way to the early 90s. Um, one year, he renovated the guest house, which Martin Luther King Jr. was going to use as a summer retreat before he was assassinated. Wow, that's a good piece of history, isn't it? The main house comes with the first floor master bedroom wing with the fireplace. There's also an original carriage house with a guest suite, a beam ceiling game room, and three bay garage. The property includes a two bedroom guest house on the hillside overlooking the main house. All right, so we're gonna take a look at this house today. We are um, not provide our inside rate. We're just gonna take a look at it. Um, if you haven't already, hit like, subscribe, show a little love, and enjoy the tour. <laughs> like it's made for me looks like the sky gonna burst apart and it's gonna rain on me i wish i could take my heart and fill the vacancy it's bound by chains and torn apart we left a memory